Dear Mr. Neumann, good to have you at Rotronic booth on sensor and test. What kind of product ST is exhibiting at Rotronic? Hello, thank you. So, ST is showing at the Rotronic board a selection of our sensors for environmental and motion recognition activities. These sensors are put on a board, on a small development board, which is called expansion board for the Nucleo series. So this is a plug and play system where you can plug on together several boards on top of this. So we have here the sensor board, the microcontroller board. We can add another board like a ranging board or the uh, Bluetooth low energy board. Here on the board we have four sensors that have six functions, which is magnetometer, accelerometer and gyro, pressure sensor and temperature sensor and humidity. Which audience ST wants to address with Nucleo Expansion Board? So, these boards are de uh, designed for developers that want to design their own system in a very fast way. So you can plug together everything, then you can download software. The software comes in four flavors, so we have just a basic software that is showing the data, as you see here. If I move it, then the data is moved and you can also start a data logger and record everything or it comes with very special software which is doing a sensor fusion which we show on this board so you see the exact movement or like a little weather station so this is everything predefined and you can just tweak it so that it works in your system if you want to do some motion recognition algorithms we have also a smaller board which basically shows everything which on this board in a very for small form factor in a watch-like style and you can test then your software on the little board. Which data Nucleo Expansion Board is able to collect and how are they processed? So the processing is done in the microcontroller here or in the small microcontroller on this board. The board itself is only showing the data so it's a uh, giving the data via I2C or SPI through this connector. And we have here, starting from the left side, the humidity temperature sensor, which is good for every um, weather station. We have a pressure sensor that can be used for altimeter. And this is a very small pressure sensor, while the humidity temperature sensor has a very good performance versus power consumption functionality. Then we have a six axis motion sensor, which is an accelerometer and gyroscope, and this is a very low noise device. And then we have a magnetometer, which is again very small power. And if there are, is a need for any other functionality, which is not on this board, but we have a lot of more sensors that can be plugged into this little DIL24 adapter board. Mr. Neumann, thank you for your time and the qualified response. Enjoy the rest of the exhibition. Thank you.